वेलकम टू न्यू सेशन द प्रॉब्लम फॉर दिस सेशन इज इट इज इन माई हार्ट डिस्क आई विल ओपन इट फॉर यू लॉट ऑफ वर्कोस इन इट लॉट मेनी स्टेटमेंट्स आई रीड रीड आउट द प्रॉब्लम फॉर यू football league table statement all major football leagues have big league tables whenever a new match is played the league table is updated to show the current rankings based on scores goals for goals against given the results of a few matches among teams write a program to print all the names of the teams in ascending order based on their rankings a win results 2 points draw 1 point loss 0 points the team with the most goals in a match wins the match goal difference is calculated from goals for and goals against teams can play a maximum of two matches against each other home and away matches the ranking is decided as follows team with maximum points is ranked 1 and minimum is placed at the end ties are broken as follows teams with same points are ranked according to goal difference if goal difference is also same then goals for if it is also same then alphabetical order more than two matches of same teams should be considered as invalid input a team cannot play matches against itself hence if team names are same for a given match it is invalid input okay now see how the input look like So this is input data. Five teams, and these are team names. Second line of input is names of teams. Number of matches played so far. Home team, away team. Goals made by home team. Goals made by away team. Okay. Here, Spain made three goals. Three goals, and England made zero goals. Here, England and France won one each. So it is a case of tie. So Spain and France. France won the game here. So France has three goals and three points. One win, one draw. So points are three. Spain only one win. England one draw, Germany zero and Italy zero. Okay, order is Italy Germany, but because their goals are same, they are arranged in alphabetical order. Okay, so let us start taking data and write a program. So first input. number of teams which is an integer now the teams team names are strings split at blank space so how many teams are there there are n teams okay next number of matches played okay next matches information let us store matches or games information number of matches or games information in a in an empty list now read game by game okay for i in range em so read first game okay let us call it as game game is equal to input 
again split it blank space okay now game 0 is team name game 1 is team name now game 2 should be converted to integer similarly game 3 game 3 should be converted integer because there are number of goals made okay now two games append game fine now to check whether data is proper or not let us call a function by name evaluate or check give it all the information you have number of teams the teams number of matches the information of games okay if it returns true if it returns false print that print that data is improper or invalid data otherwise otherwise find which one should be kept on the top of the table okay now write down the check function check data okay inputs are number of teams the teams number of matches the information of games let us create a table here table is called table it has n columns okay and it has n rows as well and all are having zero it has n rows and n columns A Jain range in fry in range in okay. So, hope parenthesis match each other now. For home team for I in range n and then J for away team for J in range in range n okay. Now, for matches. For K in range, for K in range, number of matches. Okay. Now, if from games list, first game, home team is equal to teams I and Away team is equal to teams J, then, then IJ played the match. IJ played the match. Okay. So if IJ did not play the match, then table IJ will be zero. If they played the match, it will be one okay if same teams if i played two matches against j then uh, it will become two let's do one thing this should be zero if not played if played one if it is two then data is invalid i'll tell you why So look at this. Same India USA 
played one match okay then usa india also played a match so india played what does it tell us india played india versus australia there are two matches this is india versus australia this is uh, sorry india versus us this is us versus india okay india did not play match against india usa did not play match against usa if india played two matches then it will become two and total matches are three so in any case the cell value should be either 1 or 0 should be less than or equal to 1 if it is greater than or equal to 1 then data is not proper okay so now for i in range n for j in range n if i equal to j and and table table ij is not equal to 0 then or greater than 0 then a country played against match it's same or india played a match against india so in this case you return you return false okay next if table ij is more than 1 then also return return false if you did not return false then you will be returning so so this is evaluating okay checking for the input so let us give some sample input so before going to that l sprint valid data l sprint valid data okay so let us run this save somewhere so there are five teams spain england spain england france italy and germany there are three matches spain played against england scored three goals england and france made one each now spain and france spain made zero france made two data is valid okay let us take one more case there are five teams spain england france italy and germany so three teams spain played against england and won the match 3 to 0 england and france draw spain and spain two invalid data spain cannot play a match against spain okay so evaluation is done okay now let us go ahead for, for printing the leak table here create a point table initially all the points are zero for all the teams how many teams are there pn teams are there okay next goals for table 
So Gold's fur is also zero. Next, Gold's against it is also zero. Okay, Gold difference is also zero. Okay. So let us start taking teams one by one for i in range for i in range pm okay now take matches for k in range for k in range pm the number of matches if you remember in the match results the first two values are teams next two values are goals okay now if the first value in the games is eighth team is eighth team then goals for of eighth team is equal to where are the goals goals are in third position that is second position zero position is home team one position is away team two position is goals for okay now what are goals against this is games k3 then what is goal difference this is goals for minus goals goals against okay next if goals made by the team one is more than goals made by team two then team one gets two points okay else if scored same goals both teams scored same goals in that case the points table will be updated by one okay this is home team similarly away team will away team it is at position 1 okay Uh, this is for away team away team is at position position 1 okay so goals for r 3 goals against i in position 2 this is fine okay and this should be 3 and this should be 2 okay so this is away team so rest is same okay now let us print the data so far obtained so t stands for teams f stands for goals for a stands for goals against d stands for goal difference okay in in says zip what is first list teams second list goals for okay so let us have one more points also teams points goals for goals against and goal difference so first is teams second is points next is goals for 
next is goals against next is goal difference okay so print first team name next points next goals for goals against and goal difference okay so let us run this program and check so what happened should be logical equal to here also so anything else is missing oh the thing is missing five teams so spain england spain england france italy and germany okay three matches first match spain versus england spain versus england 3 to 0 next england and france england and france one each next france say so spain and france spain made zero goals france made okay now spain won one match two points spain made how many goals three goals how many are made against spain two goals england england against england four goals england made only one goal england only tied the match france it won one match it tied one match three how many goals spain and france made here two here one three okay italy german did not play any match so working well now which one should come first france should come first why because it made more goals okay so let us do one thing let us start the information based on based on points using using bubble sort okay let n is equal to n minus 1 that is number of teams minus 1 okay so let us do bubble sort for pass in range 1 to number of passes that is n minus 1 passes okay now for i in range for i in range and the zero to end okay if points of ith team are more than points of i plus 1th team then swap points say so points of ith table if it is um, swap with points of i plus 1th country okay so points equal to points i to country sum of points i plus 1th country okay so similarly swap teams also so teams i plus 1 comma teams i okay similarly goals for okay if 
plus one comma gold square i and we need gold difference also is equal to gold difference i plus one comma gold difference i so check everything i i plus one see i plus one and i okay i i plus one i plus one i i i plus one i plus one i okay so let us not take against into consideration take only gold difference okay now change and no why to change okay bubble sort should be capital p there's pass is identifier sorry keyword five teams spain england france italy germany so three matches spain versus england 3 to 0 england france 1 and 1 Spain and France, zero and two. Okay. Where is A? Only three values. We don't need A. Five teams: Spain, England, France, Italy, and Germany. Spain, England, three zero. Sorry, number of matches. Five teams: Spain, England, France, Italy, and Germany. Three 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 matches. First match: Spain, England, three zero. Second match: England. France one one. Next match Spain France zero two. So this is in ascending order, but I want in descending order. So what should be done? Descending order. Okay. Now five teams. Spain, England, France, Italy, Germany. Three matches. Spain, England, three zero. England, France, one one. Spain, France, zero two. So first is France, next is Spain, next is England. Here, Italy and Germany scored zero goals. As per the tie-breaking rule. They must be arranged in alphabetical order. So G should come first, and I should come next. So everything is done except tie breaking. For tie breaking, you need to write some more code. Okay. So let us write that code as well. Now, for I in range, let us do one thing. We start from one, say one to n. Okay, if points of if points of i minus one the country is equal to points of i the country, then there is a tie. Okay, so to break tie, first we compare goal difference. If goal difference Of i i minus one the country is greater than goal difference of i the country. Okay, so whichever scores more goals should come first. Then you swap you swap the teams i minus one with 
with teams i okay so teams i comes first right hand side teams i and teams i plus one okay you cannot just swap, swap them you have to swap you have to swap goals for how to swap points points are same so no need to swap goals for and goals against okay a goal difference so goals for same i minus 1 of goals for is swapped with i okay equal to i and and i minus 1 okay so you copy this and paste here g of i minus 1 okay this is capital g of this is capital g of this is goal difference this is goal difference and is also goal difference okay next if they are also same they are also same or are less then go for goals for if goals for a 5 minus 1th contain is greater than i to country okay and do the same okay this is first goal difference then goals for okay so both did not work then then what you do is you arrange them in alphabetical order what is that if teams i minus 1 alphabetical but in ascending order if teams i minus 1 is greater than team i then push teams i minus 1 okay fine this is tie breaker what is this i break protein okay and what about this this is arranging countries arranging countries and please points wise okay and what about this this is to calculate points goals for goals against and goal difference okay so finally let us print the result result is only this so five teams spain England, France, Italy, Germany. Three matches: Spain and England, three zero. England, France, one one. Spain, France, zero two. Okay. Wow, bro. This is I minus one. 
this is i minus one this is i minus one so anywhere else five teams spain england france italy germany three matches spain england 3-0 england france 1-1 spain france 0-2 okay so you see here germany came first italy came next okay so france on the top of the table so hope you understand it so we did lot many things here first first checking the data then scoring then finding points goals for goals against goals difference and then arranging countries points wise and then breaking the tie okay so hope you understand it is a very very important